epigenetic. I could never understand why people have dogs chained. He has one chain in the small with the small um one of the small thing there and the other one with that big container. Why are they chaining the dogs? He has a house and has fence. If that belongs to him, he has a house that's fence. Looks like it fence around. You know, that's to me anybody's caught doing that the dog should be taken away that's cruel to me personally that's cruelty to animals this is the same maxwell main road i'm still in maxwell main road this is the opposite there and it's the open um ground right here you know this is you know look at the poor dog i think they should they should, they should really stop that um that really bad habit in chaining having the dogs chain i see it all over barbados and I, to me personally, it's cruelty to animals because I think if you have a dog, your dog should be fenced around, able to run around, drink water, do whatever. You know, the, the dogs don't get no recreation when they chain like this. I see it all over Barbados and some in worse condition. Look at this dog, for example. It's it's fenced around and it's 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 happy running, maybe running around. You know, it's, it's not chained. It's not chained. You have to stop that bad habit. I see it all over Barbados. I wonder if that's legal to have a dog chain and just chained. Sometimes the sun is so hot and the dogs have no way. I mean, in fairness, this is a little better. The dog has a little house. The other one could go under the bed if the um, container. But it's still, to me personally, if you if you want to have a dog, they should be fenced, able to run around. And it's not more that they can't, you know, they don't get exercise or nothing. They just chain, you know, that's not good enough.